Hello guys, Silva Butterflies here. I viewed today on the postcard with three perfumes uh, of a jewelry, David Yurman. Exotic essence, delicate uh, essence, and fresh essence. And is devoted to the um, jewelry stones. So, a trio of evocative uh, fragrances echoing the artistry of David Yurman's jewelry and emotions of, the, of his radiant gemstones, glistering citrine, lustrous pink uh, tourmaline, and vivid peridot. The David Yurman Essence Collection is a fusion of art and beauty, designed to be worn alone or paired, mixed to express your individual style. So I already applied this, all three on me. First one, I applied the green one. It's very delicate, uh, nice, uh, like apple, green apple perfume with this uh, flowery twist. The pink one is called Delicate Essence, Romantic and Feminine. This first one is Crisp and Playful. Romantic and Feminine is like a mixture of rose and peony. It's also so nice. And the third one, I think it's more amber and um, some woody tones in Exotic Essence. So what I say, the color coordination is exactly what is needed uh, for this, uh, you know, explanation of the whole line. Because it's the jewelry, um, some people like uh, different jewelry pieces and stones, and it's like a little final touch to your uh, jewelry pieces, whatever you wear on a party or some event or birthday party. So I saw regret. I didn't grab it uh, back in the day. In the beginning, it was uh, expensive. Then it became, it's actually disappeared from the shelves. Then it appeared only once a discounted section. I thought, well, it will come again and it never came back. So that's it, Salavi. Too bad because probably they didn't uh, put much uh, uh, amount or a lot of amount for this uh, launch, and people who bought it they use it once and they forgot about it. And I wanna just tell you a little piece of history in perfumery of David Yurman. Another one, uh, this brochure. I grabbed it at the store, I want to get rid of it, but I want to keep this part just because it's like a masterpiece made it on black. J'adore, uh, Miss Cherie, uh, was it Miss Dior, and uh, poison, hypnotic poison with uh, Charlene Theron on the background. This all cosmetics is also good, but this one is even worthwhile to put in a frame and put it on a wall, like a wall of fame. Of Dio perfumery. What else? I have uh, a Lacoste. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this man. Uh, all hairy chest. It's nowadays men are shaving uh, their chest and it's, to my opinion, looks so ugly. I think should, they should be more natural because when they're shaving their chest, it looks like a lion decided to be naked. <laughs> and uh, they shake all his mane off so anyway that's my opinion i smelled it here uh, the smell is divine it's exactly what a woman would love back then and even nowadays at least me it's a eau de toilette made in uk lacoste style on skin i so surprised i still have this uh, little sample it's sometimes you just uh, toss in your documents and you see something like that <laughs> and the third one thing fourth actually I'm gonna read you very brief uh, cocktails recipe from this little uh, brochure this is rum fast easy and delicious water uh, divinely easy way to shake up the summer it's too bad it's not summer anymore but anyway rum no time no problem 
each of cocktails in this section can be prepared in under a minute. Okay, mango magic, half an ounce of rum, three ounces of mango juice, two ounces of lemonade or frozen concentrate. Or mango mocktail is uh, three ounces of mango juice, two ounces of lemonade, uh, frozen concentrate. So the second one is even without alcohol. Then it goes uh, the Bacardi uh, Hurricane, Malibu Mango Medley, the Coco Craze, and Monkey Uncle. I like Monkey Uncle. One ounce of Sangster Jamaican Rum Cream, half an ounce uh, Appleton Estate of Jamaica Rum, and half an ounce Cream de Banan. Then it goes Muskoko ice cream, iced tea, sorry, and shoot the breeze with vodka. Then it goes again, this kind of stuff, vodka. Grand Cosmo, Absolute Mandarin Blossom, Bolivar Black Russian, and the Kalua White Russian. So I just read both. The Bolivar Black Russian, uh, three three fourths of Bolivar coffee liquor, three quarters of um, three fourths of eager vodka, shake together. This Kalua white is uh, one ounce of Kalua, one ounce of polar ice vodka, and one ounce of milk cream. I, I will be happy if I will be help off, but I don't know how to mix cocktails myself. This is Lone Kiss Goodnight Martini. I like the name. The sun is gone. Um, half ounces of Tolly uh, Vanille Vodka, one ounce of Tolly Vodka, and half an ounce of Maginus uh, with white cream de cacao. This one. Raspberry Ricky tip of the iceberg, the vanilla sky. Then it goes uh, Jeers and Gadgets, Tequila and Gin. Then it goes Gin and Tequila. Lychee Spritzer, Lychee Mocktail, uh, the Sundowner Cocktail, Catalina Margarita, the Classic Margarita, the Tanqueray Classic Martini. You can put the stop button and read it. Rude Cosmo, Jose Cuervo Margarita, the Melon Margarita, and Wild Thing. Pure and easy tips. First, easy mango moves. Avoid overripe mangoes, mushy to the touch. They're stingy and hard to slice. Chilling cocktails, smooth slicing, icebreakers. Okay, this whiskey and liquors over here. The memory is almost over, so I say goodbye just in case. And this is my trap.